Welcome. Liberance, I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. All right, Liberance, let's go in your breathing. All right, Liberance. This is going to be a really positive month for you, Liberance. Um, um, you have three, um, like major, major, this is new. Um, you liberals at work is going to be coming out in a positive, positive way. A lot of you liberals who are going to be starting a new job. Yay, yay, yay. Uh, a lot of you liberals who were looking for a new job. Yay, yay, yay. It is going to be good. Wonderful alignment of energy. So, what is happening in transpiring? There is some sort of a new start that is going to be coming up. A lot of you liberals could be receiving the offer of a new job. Take it, run with it, move forward, okay? A lot of you liberals are going to be freed from some sort of a imbalanced situation that was transpiring and some sort of an unconventional um, job situation. Uh, it could be someone is leaving and you're going to be so happy that this person is leaving, okay? Um, and this is going to be good. So however it is happening, a lot of you liberals in this month of May is going to be getting a new start. The two first week is going to be good. The two, the two last weeks, you're going to be coming up with some sort of an issue, um, that is going to be transpiring, but you're moving forward. And that is about the most important thing is, is that you could be climbing the ladder. You're moving forward up the ladder. You're letting go of uh, things that has been happening and transpiring. Okay. In your foundation, you have the energy of the nine of wands. Okay. So, um, the nine of wands energy is about some sort of information and data and you are trying to protect yourself. Okay. So if you recognize, uh, um, what is coming up in this cross is that uh, you're freeing yourself. Someone is leaving. This is about someone is leaving a new start in a new corporation institution. You're moving forward. And in the cross, we have uh, the energy of the eye princess, uh, um, where information, something is going to be coming in, some sort of a information that is going to be pushing you forward. Some sort of a information data is going to be coming out that is going to give you a huge leap forward in your position. So expect this. Uh, your wishes and dream is going to be coming out because um, some data information about a Leo, people are going to be recognizing and finding out some sort of information about a Leo that has been working against a lot of you. Some of you are going to be finding out why you haven't been moving forward and you're going to be recognizing that a Leo had block you from moving forward. A lot of you are dealing with Pisces, um, Leos, uh, Pisces and Scorpion, um, Sagittarian. Okay. A lot of you are dealing with Sagittarian. Um, and, and a lot of you are dealing with Pisces. Now, whatever it is around Pisces and Leo at the workplace, uh, light is going to be shed because it's like a Scorpion is going to be letting you know, hey, a scorpion is going to be saying, hey, did you know that the Pisces and the Leo is the one that has been uh, really keeping you back? So this is going to be good because at the end of the day, you're going to be recognizing that your colleagues, people that you have called your colleagues and your co-workers are the one um, that you have been dealing with. These are people who you thought had your back. You're going to be recognizing that these people have never had your back. And um, for a lot of you, you're going to be recognizing this, but at the same time, you're going to be freeing yourself. You're going to be freeing yourself from the situation and recognizing, hey, I am letting go of this situation. I am freeing myself because I need to be free from the situation and whatever that was happening and transpiring. You are releasing. And this is going to be good because it's as if the shift of energy around you liberals at the workplace in the month of May is going to be good. What is so um, crazy is that uh, as you come in this uh, month of May at the workplace, your wishes and dreams is going to be released. Where 
uh, a lot of you could be starting a new job while a lot of you could be having some sort of a promotion while a lot of you is going to be receiving some sort of a news um, that is going to be freeing you and you're going to be very, very celebrative. You're going to be extremely celebrative because you're being free um, where there could have been people and issues that was creating blockages for you. So in the first week, expect a lot of happiness and joy. Someone is going to be leaving or some of you could be deciding to leave um, your work, okay? Number 99 is here, okay? And it's about positive emotions because it's as if whatever data and information, nine is about data and information and about a whole lot of work, and um, it could be that some of you start for your, you know, start your little private business at home and recognizing, hey, I am doing much better at home. I'm going to be focusing on my own business. That is something where you're freeing yourself from the corporate world. You're freeing yourself from your everyday nine to five job, and it's going to be thinking of um, starting your own. Um, business and is going to be exhilarating in this. So, so that is good. Some sort of a positive, positive news coming in. And it's something that you have been waiting for. So this could be also a promotion or a company that you have always wanted to go and work for is going to be offering you some sort of a start or some of you are going to be getting a lot of work opportunities coming up. Then when we look, we see the second week you moving forward and this is good. So information is going to be coming out. Whatever this information is that is coming out is going to be giving you some sort of a um, strong foundation to stand on. And this is going to be good because people are now recognizing that you have been blocked and have been um, derailed by people and now whatever the information that is coming at you is going to be giving you a real good push start moving forward. You know, recognizing and leaving um, people and situation that was um, toggling on you at the workplace. OK, so uh, this is a good time, especially the first week and second week. It's going to be a good time because in the second week, whatever this information is that people were keeping against you at the workplace, it is going to be coming out. And uh, that information will give you strong grounds to stand on. And, you know, in the third week, you're going to be recognizing that uh, a whole lot of information came out why you have been stuck at some sort of a position at the work floor. And they're going to be telling you, someone is going to be really saying, hey, no one had any faith in you or someone has said you couldn't do your job or, but it's going to be coming out. And it's as if it is time for you liberals to understand why you have not been taking up the rain and moving forward. It's because uh, um, a Leo and a Pisces had bad mounted you. A Leo and a Pisces had not spoken well about you. A Leo and a Pisces is the one that say that you could not uh, work or take on the work or position. That's why you have moved from where you are and moved up the ladder. So in the third week, the third week is going to be um, a week of where you recognize that the same people you were having lunch with, going out, collaborating with, you know, having a laugh with, it's the same people that spoke um, about you and, and, and never helped you. And they have been moving up the ladder and you have not been going anywhere. And it's because of these people. So... Um, you know, this is going to be a really, really um, positive month because this month, especially in the third week, is going to be recognized because a scorpion is going to be saying, hey, Leo, you know, I got some news for you. And, you know, you got to keep watch the people who you're hanging around with because those are the same people that is keeping you back. For some of you, it's going to be sad, but it is a situation where your guides and angel wanted you to know this information. Your guides and angel recognize that, hey, Librens is not aware of what has been happening and transpiring. Librens, you need to, um, you know, recognize that you have been um, work against by the same people 
who you're wasting time with. They are the one that is climbing the ladder and leaving you. So with this information, you're going to be finding out for yourself, hey, I got to pull up my bootstrap. I got to recognize what is happening. I got to recognize, hey, I got to pull up my bootstrap. I got to recognize what is taking place. And I got to um, recognize that I need to, um, to be, uh, um, you know, changing the way I look at where I am and how long I've been in the same position and I have not moved out of this position. So whatever the information is, whatever that is happening, whatever that is transpiring, it is about you recognize that, hey, I wasn't even aware that these people, that was their thoughts about me. And, and you know, it's as if these are people that you have known and have been with, uh, you know, having coffee breaks, uh, you know, whatever together and that sort of a thing. And it's going to hit you. It's going to hit you in the third week. But guess what? It is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. Now, at least you have some sort of an information that you recognize, you know, what, what was blocking you, what was stopping you, what was keeping you from being a success and succeed. So now you have the information, let it go, run with it. You know, understand that people have their own ideas and it is people ideas over who you are. So let it go um, be understanding and understand that at least you found out why you have not been um, moving um, forward and, and, you know, moving in the right direction is because uh, of people and their opinions that they had over you. So this is going to be a wake up call in this month, but the wake up call is going to be good because with the wake up call, you're going to be having data and information at your advantage um, in order to create some sort of a new stability moving forward. And this is going to be good. In the last week, a lot of you are enduring or trying to endure to a situation. Maybe um, this week you're working with someone who you really do not like working with and you're trying to endure the whole week. It could be a situation that you recognize that, the, you know, whoever the supervisor is or whoever this person is, you know, has been really bad in you. And, um, you know, you have to work with this person and you are trying to sustain and endure to this week, okay? And you, it is not going to be a very positive um, week uh, because you recognize that the same people that you have been coaxing with is the same people that has been also bad mouthing you. So um, some of you are going to be finding out that a Sagittarian has been uh, your blockage your you know the Sagittarian has been blocking you a lot of you are going to be recognizing that is a Leo a lot of you are going to be getting data and information that a Leo and a Sagittarian has been the one that has been working against you along with a Pisces so it is as if some sort of information and whoever the Scorpion is um that is the energy of the Scorpion the, sh the Scorpion shed light on information and situation okay Scorpions let you know and give you an idea of the people who have been, um, you know, putting a spokes in your wheel. And the last week, it is going to be a week of you enduring and it's a situation where you have to deal with a Sagittarian and whoever the Sagittarian is, you know, you can't wait until the week is over because you recognize that the Sagittarian was someone who you associated yourself with and you could not have believe that the Sagittarian would have worked together and coax with other people against you. So it is a week of wrecking, a month of wrecking, a month of wrecking that, um, you know, people don't always have your good uh, intention, okay? It's not, you're going to be recognizing that whoever the Sagittarian is had never had good intentions for you. This person was having... A, a, a sort of a, oh, let me see um, how far this person is going to be going, you know. And has been showing people that, oh, this person is not going to make it through whatever. So this person was um, smiling at one side of the mouth, but expecting something you to fail in the other side. So be aware of this while it's transpiring, all right? So Librans, expect some sort of a news to come in, but whatever this news is, 
is going to be giving you a good stability. Okay, this data and information um, at the workplace is going to be freeing you. And you're going to be recognized is that the same people that you have been collaborating with is the same people that throw you under the bus and block you from moving forward. I do love you, Librans. Please like, shares, and thumbs up, thumbs up. We're going further with this reading. I can't do like a, a long reading. And people do not understand how to do readings because you got to give people what they need to know. All right, in order to, to know what is coming out for us to the other side, it is just a dollar ninety nine for the extended reading. I do love you guys. I gotta go. I'll see you on the other side. If not, I will see you in the bi monthlies.